Hi, my name is Maria. I'm a mathematician, and today I'm going to show you the steps to prime factorization. So we're going to do prime factorization by using a factor tree. So if I've got the number 36 and I want to find its prime factorization, what I need to do first is think of any two factors of 36, besides 36 and 1. So think of two numbers that can be multiplied to get to 36, and the numbers that I think of are 12 and 3. Now what you want to do is, as you're breaking down your number into its factors, if you see a prime factor, like 3, you're going to go ahead and circle it because you're done breaking it down, okay? Now I'm going to go on to 12 and break 12 down into further factors. So two numbers that I think of that go into 12 are 4 and 3. Now I see another prime number there, so I'm going to go ahead and circle it. So 4, I've got to continue breaking down. Two numbers that I know that go into 4 are 2 and 2. These are both prime, so I'm going to circle that, circle that. I'm done breaking it down. Every branch of my tree has been circled. So now what you do is you rewrite all the factors in order from least to greatest, and I'm going to cross it out every time I write it so I don't miss one. So 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. This 2 times 2 times 3 times 3 is the prime factorization of 36 in standard form, but normally we like to write it in exponential form. So any factor that you see that repeats itself, we're going to write it with exponents. So 2 times 2 can be rewritten as 2 squared, and 3 times 3 can be rewritten as 3 squared. So the prime factorization of 36 is 2 squared times 3 squared, and that's how you do prime factorization.